Hello, this is the Foundry Collection. Foundry has an industrial look and was inspired by things like this old padlock where the finish has worn down over time. Most of us don't have industrial looking artwork to frame for our homes, so it's important that Foundry goes with other things as well. This reproduction of a painting of a cityscape, a photo of a city, things like this print with hard lines to it, paper collage, mixed media art, and it also works especially well with soft abstracts like this due to the matte finish. Because of the lack of ornamentation on the molding, things like a pencil sketch or an en engraving that has detail to it. Foundry moldings stack really well with each other. You can combine frames from the same finish or when appropriate, mix and match the finishes together. One of the most interesting combinations that we've seen so far is to use the cube combined with this unique float profile and put the cube inside. You can mix and match foundry with other collections that are metallic looking. This has more of a sheen to it than the matte finish of the foundry, so it works really well. And because there is no ornamentation on the foundry frames, you can also add frames to it that have their own pattern. And depending on that pattern, you create really unique looks. This one having a little bit more of an industrial look itself. When appropriate, you can add color. So we can combine something like that to add color to go with that print. Or you can also match patterns in the artwork by adding an enhancer or something like a fillet. Foundry, because of the unique finish having a brighter outside edge and darker panels in the middle, works with multiple matte colors. These being conservation boards. This is a suede which works especially well because of the modeled finish. And because of those brighter outside edges, even metallics work really well. Well, that's some design inspiration using our Foundry collection. Now I hope you'll go out and have some fun with it. <laughs>